What's up guys, Sim here, and this is Street Race Talk episode 47. And before we get into all the news and stuff today, I just want to say happy Veterans Day and thank you to all the veterans out there and everyone who has served in the military. You are greatly appreciated from me and a lot of other people out there. And we'll never be able to thank you enough, so I'll just say thank you. But first thing is Kamikaze. He's been doing a lot of work on the Elko, and if you've been following him on Facebook... You know he how much work he's been doing. And he's getting ready for some race that's going on this weekend, I'm assuming. No, no, I'm pretty sure this weekend. And I'm assuming that it is with Chief and the rest of the 405. But I'm not sure. I've, to be honest, I have no idea what the race is. So, yeah. Kai Kelly will be at Hub City Dragway tonight for a small tire cash days. Uh, Murder Nova just... I think it was just yesterday or the day before they did this. They put in carbon fiber wheel tubs on the car to make it lighter. And from this we can tell that the new car isn't for a while. The Killer Nova, that's not, we're not going to be seeing that car for a while. Because if they're still doing modifications to this car, then that means they're planning on racing this car for a lot longer. And... That's, I'm glad to see they're making it lighter, so hopefully with all these pro mods, it'll still be able to compete. Uh, Jeff Lutz, I believe this was yesterday, set a new street legal car record, which was 587 at 251 miles an hour. That's just insane. I mean, Larry, I was, I thought it was crazy when Larry Larson ran sixes in his Nova, but now Jeff Lutz is running 587. That's just crazy. And now, before we get into the main topic of today, I just want to say that, uh, what was it? I think it was last week or the week before, I was saying, I was talking about Chief and his car, and then I said some stuff, and you guys were getting all mad about what, like, saying the stuff I said was wrong, saying, he's never going Hemi. But if you listen to the podcast, he said that, he was talking to some guy and he was like, yeah, that dude has a Hemi. He's like, I'm trying to get one of those to put in my car. I mean, I don't know what, if that doesn't mean he's trying to get a Hemi, I don't know what does. So, yeah. And so, put that out of the way, time for the main topic. Daddy Dave got rid of the nitrous and got a Pro Charger. That's just crazy. Because he, I think when he was on... The Chief and Sean show, actually, going back to the podcast again. Uh, he said that that car will eventually be turbo, but he got a Pro Charger, which I'm shocked about. I was, I thought for sure he would be switching a twin turbo when he would switch it. And also, I'm shocked he switched so early. He's had the car for like a year now, and he's already changing it from Nitrous to Pro Charger, which is, I have... To be honest, I know nothing about Pro Chargers, and I have no idea, like, if it's better than Turbos or better than Nitrous. Obviously, he thinks it's better than Nitrous if he's getting rid of Nitrous for it, or it's because he just doesn't want to do all the work that the Nitrous guys have to do. And, yeah, that's really cool to see him going Pro Charger. I believe the only other guy on the list right now that that is Pro Charger is Shane. And just saying last Street Outlaws episode I thought was really boring. I just didn't like it at all. But next week they race some out of town guys. And I think uh, Stinky Pinky, the man in that Camaro, he's on there. And some other. It looked like it was all track racers, not street racers at all. But who knows. Oh, and one other thing I wanted to say is I talked about uh, how Chief and Sean have brought a lot more people to uh radial races and everyone's like no duck had tons of fans before and i wasn't talking about that race in particular there's tons of people that always go to that race but what i was mainly saying was with chief and sean doing all these radial races they introduced radial racing to a lot more people like me i didn't really follow radial racing or like it that much before they did it and it's bringing street racers that normally would never consider radial racing to radial racing and bringing the fans along with it. I'm not saying that it wasn't didn't have a lot of fans before. I'm saying that they're 
adding on a lot more new fans. So yeah, just I just remember that right now. I just want to get it out of the way. But yeah, Daddy Dave went pro charger. I'm shocked about it. Got rid of the nitrous that he talked so highly of. And yeah, he's now a pro charger. And looks like that is it for this week. Tune in next week for Street Race Talk episode 48. We're almost at 100 subscribers. That's awesome. And yeah, follow me on social media. Links will be in the description. And this is Sim ABC XYZ signing out.